join me and Nikki Hobday and Alexandrina Hensley as we're about to open the Swim Olympics at Tate Modern 2. We're just going to document Faraz's amazing technique. A moment ago, Faraz got 14.25, which is the highest score uh, ever at the Swivel Olympics at Tate Modern, and he's going to demonstrate it for us again. It's an unusual technique, but it seems to really work. And he's off. Two, three, I think this could even be higher than before. Five. Don't mess it up, Faraz. Seven. No, no, keep going. Never give up. Never give up. Is that 10? 11. Yeah, and now look what he's doing. He's bringing himself in. 12. Oh, uh, not 12 and, 12 and a quarter. 12 and a half. It was only a 12 and a half, but that was still very impressive. Round of applause for Faraz. He is at the avant-garde of Swivel Olympics experimentation. That was very good. Um, thank you, Faraz. You're a Swivel Olympian. No one can take that away from you. Um, this is the Swivel Olympics, ladies and gentlemen. So it makes it better or worse with your eyes closed? Oh, completely better. Oh, really? Yeah. No pressure, Victoria, but let's see how it goes. We're here with Victoria at the Swivel Olympics. She's getting up some speed now. And she's off. Two. Three. Four. Five. She's actually speeding up as she brings her legs in close to her body. Eight. Nine, this is remarkable. Ten, she's getting quicker and quicker. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, seventeen and a half, seventeen three quarters, eighteen. Eighteen, that's a new record for Tate Modern. Well done, I knew you could do it, congratulations. Victoria just got 18 at the Swivel Olympics, it's amazing. She used the Gregorio technique, and that means that she gets one of these. Well done, although well, someone might beat your record, so keep practicing, will you? That was amazing. What a technique! It's a silver medal because you've got the second highest score of the day. The thing is, yeah. There you go. Thank you very much. Well done to you. That's great. Silver medal is achieved. You're a Swivel Olympian now, you know I can take that away from you. And by taking part in the Swivel Olympics, you are all Swivel Olympians as well. I am Richard, the head of the International Swivel Olympics Committee. I invented the sport. This is Nikki Hobday. This is Alexandrina Hemsley. They also work for the International Swivel Olympics Committee. Um, we need to watch you do your spin if you want them to go onto the scoreboard. Bob, well done Bob. Nikki Hovday from the International Swivel Olympics Committee is now going to demonstrate um, her preferred Swivel Olympics technique. Whilst she's practicing, I'm just going to have a look out of this window. Look at this. And she's off. Two, three, four, five, six. I think it's that thing on your arm that's slowing you down. Six and a half, six and three quarters. Seven. I'm giving you a seven for that. It's not bad, Nikki Hobday. A small round of applause for Nikki Hobday. She's frustrated. She knows that she can do better. And she will by the end of this weekend. We're here all weekend, ladies and gentlemen. He's off. Two, three, four, five. Shoes are off. Six, seven. Oh, Silas! Silas, he brought shame on the family, Victoria. Shame, shame on you, Silas. Oh my God, that's never happened before, ladies and gentlemen. For the first time this afternoon, we've got the room to ourselves at the Swim Olympics, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. For one, oh, for one second, for one second. Back to the, back to the grindstone. That was going well, why did you stop? Nikki Hobday has been um, overdoing it a little bit at the Swivel Olympics. 